Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's talk about the problem 54 in chapter 2. And uh, I suggest you to draw a picture to understand what happens. It can say the best rebounder in the basketball has a vertical leap. So the keyword vertical leap tells us the initial velocity is pointing up, right? Because it is getting a jump of about 120 centimeters. There, we must convert the unit to international system unit meter. So it tells us that in the peak position. And when it arrives, the peak's velocity becomes zero. What is its initial net speed? And how long are they in the air? So in these problems, we can see the acceleration always pointing down. We must keep the negative side there. And the unknown is initial velocity and time taking. And then we choose this one as reference point. So initial position is zero, final position is zero. After you choose this picture, what happens? It is exactly the same as the problem 53 in chapter 2, right? It's just the different masks. They tell you the same quantities, just the different numbers. So the first one, how do you decide the initial velocity? We look at this part, part one. From the initial to the peak, we know the peak velocity. We know the peak position. When in the initial, we know initial position. And we also know acceleration. So we want to know initial velocity. So the equation to this one is the velocity with displacement equation. See, this one and input the lower quantities, this one. And then we, we can solve the initial velocities by squared 2GYP, right? Input the numbers, we are done. 4.8 meter per second. The second one asks you how long are they in the air? How long are they in the air? Still the same thing. We can consider we know initial position, we know final position, we know acceleration, and we also know initial velocity at zero. So, which one? The displacement function with the time taking t, this one, remember? And then input the lower quantities. We can get, solve the time t as 2v0 divided by g, and then input the numbers. It is around one second. So you can see when we solve the problems, we, I suggest you just uh, draw the picture and then list the lower quantities and unknown quantity. You can see some problems. They are exactly the same, just they change masks, right? Thank you.